This PlayStation 4 coverage is brought to you by AppWin.com, a site where you can win prizes by downloading and rating apps. Be sure to check it out using the link below. Hey guys, who are you? David Franco here. Uh, what is with me? I can't make this video without smiling. Maybe because I look so chill? Anyway guys, how the heck are you? David DeFranco here from DeFrancoGaming.com with an unboxing of another PlayStation 4 accessory. This time I am unboxing the PlayStation camera, which works in conjunction with this. How convenient. Look at that. Look at that movie magic. The DualShock 4, more specifically the light bar on the back of the DualShock 4. Guys, I'm loving this light. I mean, granted, I haven't had the camera before today. But I just love the light because it looks amazing. And in Killzone, it actually changes the color based on your health. So if you're healthy, it's green. And if you're practically dying, it's like a freaking bright as hell saturated red. And it looks really cool. But anyway, that's beside the point. I am just here to unbox the PlayStation camera. The first camera of two. Damn it, I need the knife. And by first camera of two, I am obviously, well, maybe it's not obvious to everyone, but I am talking about the Xbox One Connect, which I will have as of this Friday. So I'm very excited about having two consoles, well, two cameras on my consoles watching me at all times. That kind of freaks some people out, but I'm fascinated by it. Although this is not always on technology, unlike the Xbox One. This is just a camera. And it's 720p, I believe. And the Xbox One's camera is 1080p. And it works in pretty much pure you know, pitch black darkness, whereas this doesn't. And the Xbox One has deep, deep integration with voice commands, while this doesn't. It lets you do voice commands either using this or the headset, but it's very basic voice commands and not nearly as in-depth as the Xbox One. So I really hope Sony improves in that area. I know that's not important to some people, but I really like when companies push the boundaries. I mean, the Xbox One looks incredible. The technology behind it and the connect and snapping the TV on the side of your games, or Twitter, or football scores, or just multitasking while gaming, or even Skyping. That might not be important to everyone, and I may be in the minority when I say that, but I am a huge believer in the Xbox One and the new Kinect. I just think the technology is incredible. Anyway, this video is not about Kinect, but I am obviously very excited about that, and I'll talk about that more this Friday of my Xbox One unboxing. So subscribe to my channel, please, if you're not already subscribed and you can look forward to that. But the point is, I am looking very forward to having both of these cameras hooked up. Now obviously, I did not buy this for gaming purposes because there's only really one thing that supports the camera right now, as far as I know, and that's the Playroom app, and that's installed on every PlayStation 4 by default. But that does look really cool. I mean, it's kind of gimmicky, but hey, it's a demo to show off what this thing is capable of. And from what I've seen, it looks incredible. But the real reason I got this camera is for the built-in Twitch integration on the PS4. It's just incredible. The fact that I can use this as my face cam and my headset or whatever for audio. I can also use this for audio, but I'm not going to do that because I'm at least six feet from my TV, so I can't imagine the audio quality sounding too good. So I will be using a uh, headset of some kind. All right. Anyway, I really love to talk. This is a mounting device which actually kind of looks like a Lego brick. Not the whole thing, but right here. Because I guess it snaps in. Because I have seen IGN's video. So basically that can sit on top of the TV like so. Or at least wrap around. I'm not entirely sure. It obviously varies depending on your setup. But this thing will just be simply going on my center speaker. So it's very convenient for me. And then well, no, it's center speaker, Xbox One Connect, since it's bigger than this. And then, then this will go on top of my Xbox One Connect. I'm so excited about having all this technology in my living room. I just think it's incredible. But you guys know that already. Okay, here it is, the PlayStation camera. Without further rambling. I gotta say, and I've said this before, not on video, but kind of to myself when I've seen videos and pictures. Doesn't it look like a big Tootsie Roll? Like one of those large Tootsie Rolls that you can buy, like the thick ones? I just want to bite it off and eat it. Anyway, it's got dual 720p cameras with, I think, four microphones. Four microphones, that's pretty insane. And a cable, which apparently is not long enough for certain entertainment setups. I've seen people say on um, Amazon reviews that the cable could be longer. Because as you know, the Kinex cable is freaking long as hell. 
But this is definitely long enough for mine. Let me just unravel it to give you guys an idea. Yeah, yeah, that's plenty long. My PS4 isn't far from my center speaker. So here it is, it's very light, nice quality it feels. I mean, it, it doesn't feel too cheap. By the way, this did cost $60 on Amazon. I believe it's $60, but I will put this on Gear Pop, and you never know, you can save a few bucks here and there. Let me take this off. Oh my God, how many times did they roll this thing around? There you go. And there you go, guys. I mean, there's really nothing else I'm gonna tell you about the PlayStation camera. This is just an unboxing. But I promise, I had to make a quick jump cut there, messing up. Um, I promise I will give you an in-depth tour of the PlayStation Dynamic Menu of which I will take that video opportunity to give you a quick tour or, or at least a quick preview of the PlayStation camera and the Playroom app because again, I do think it's really, really cool technology. I just hope Sony and the other video game developers put this to its, you know, to, to good use basically, uh, but we'll see. Again, I just mainly got this for Twitch integration and from what I can tell, I'm going to enjoy that. By the way, real quick before I go, this should mount on the bottom. Yep, there you go. Makes you think of Wally. -E. Doesn't it look like a robot because it had two eyes? All right, anyway, there's my unboxing of the PlayStation camera. I know, very riveting, but stay tuned for more coverage. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for your continued support. Let me know what you think of this. Is it something you're interested in or is it something you really just don't give a crap about? And I'll see you in tomorrow's video which might be my Killzone Shadowfall review for the PS4. So stay tuned. Peace. AppWin.com is a site where you can win prizes like iPods, iPads, gift cards, and more simply by downloading and rating apps. Get started right away by using the link below.